Hey guys, Amazon here, and I have another Armament review for you guys today. <clears throat> and today, it is the Timmy Toys Combat Patrol Army Vehicles and Artillery. It's a four-piece set, and it's made in the USA. Um, because it's Timmy, I got it from VictoryBuy.com, and this is one of the many new things they just put on the website. I'll put the link in the description below so you can go check it out. And just like last time, we're going to go through the packaging, but there really isn't much to it, so that'll probably be really quick. It's just the plastic bag that they come in, and this header, which has some very nice artwork on it. And on the back, it tells you where the stickers go, which, uh, by the way, for the stickers, they're the old Timmy stickers that used to be on old sets in the 60s. So it's really nice to see them again, but I'm not putting them on right now because, as I've said, it's green versus, like, tan and all that, not USA versus tan and all that. But now, since the packaging's all out of the way, we're going to move into the vehicles themselves. But since the vehicles are pretty much identical, I'm going to just do one of them. So the Jeep itself, it's very well built. It's not going to break, even though it's hollow right there. But it's very well held together, and it has strong metal axles that let it roll very, very well. And unfortunately, the windshield does not come up, and the steering wheel does not turn. But if you get a radio operator army man and slide him in right there, he will stay. He will sometimes stay there, so you can be like a driver. Also, you can fit a machine gunner back here. I tested it, and it sort of works. And also, it comes with a 35mm anti-tank gun on the back, and how you get it off easily, you turn it this way and pull up. One second. I didn't turn it all the way. But here's the gun itself. It's very, very... I mean, it's pretty well detailed, actually. Not very well, but it's pretty well detailed. It's also pretty sturdy, comes with the same metal axles, it's also pretty hollow, and, but still, it's really nice. And I know there wasn't much to the set, so it's probably a little bit shorter, but I will be doing more arm interviews soon. So guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. Please like, comment, or subscribe to my channel, and I'll see you guys next time. Thanks for watching.